Saturday Night Football, it's the Hawks versus the Swans. Remember, you can get all games at afl.com.au forward slash dice footy to make it really feel like the footy. I charge myself $12 for a beer just now. The Hawks are yet to find a win in the Telstra ADFL, and hence they've changed their team, bringing in James Warple, the Warpedo, and the Swans going with the always consistent performer in Luke Parker. Sit back or stand up, I'm not going to tell you what to do. It's bound to be an epic clash, though, between the Hawthorne Hawks and the Sydney Swans. Big game. Both players seem pumped up. We'll see if we can get a word with uh, James Warple just before he heads out. James, are you there? Yep, I'm here, Andy. Fantastic. Sicily dropped after an appalling performance last week. The only player in the whole competition to mix the, miss the box entirely. Um, did you see him during the week? I haven't seen him. I don't think anyone's seen him during the week. I think he's gone into hiding. Um, <laughs> I think he knows he performed putridly, so um, we'll let him let him sit at home by himself. Yeah, yeah, fair enough. Uh, we're crossing now to uh, Luke Parker of the Sydney Swans. Uh, Luke, of course, um, Josh Kennedy rolled well. Uh, any reason why he was rested this week? Uh, look, I think, um, look, he's starting to lose his hair with age. Um, so, look, he's had to... Have a little bit of our treatment on that this week. So, look, we've had to stand him down for the week and I'm here to fill the spot. Fair enough. Uh, do you feel like uh, Buddy would go okay? Do you reckon he has an arc when he comes into roller dice? Yeah, he would. He'd probably have a chance to miss the box. But, um, look, his coordination is in his, his legs. So, when it comes to hands, um, he's got hands like feet. So, um, look, I think it's best that I, I take the reins. <laughs> oh, there's the morning siren. We'll let you go as we have both captains together now for the toss of the coin. And I understand that Isaiah is standing by. Isaiah, are you there? Hi. Hi, Isaiah. Are you a Hawks fan? Yep. Great. Have you got a message for the Warpedo before you toss the coin for us today? Um, I never give up. Never give up. Uh, that's great. Thanks, mate. <laughs> it, is, it is good. Okay, as I toss the coin, it's your call, Luke Parker. I'll go heads, mate. <laughs> oh, heard it bounce the floor. Um, I think so. Mum? Head. Heads. Heads. It's a Sydney Swans win. Early momentum for them. Thanks, Isaiah. We'll let you go. Bye. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, show us your sign, mate. You did, did all that effort. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, look yeah, at that. Enough. Great sound. <laughs> okay, Parks, it's your choice. Do you want to roll first or would you like to send the Hawks in to roll? Uh, I think I'll roll first and hopefully put pressure on in the end. Okay, sit back and enjoy what will be an epic quarter as we get into this game. Sydney Swans versus the Hawthorne Hawks. Quarter number one now for Saturday Night Football. Parker has got the dice in hand. Off you go, bud. Six hits! What a start! What a start! <laughs> Kane Corns would still call that roll overrated, even though it's the best you can get, probably because it doesn't come out of port. 42 points for Luke Parker on the original roll. Warps, your chance for the reply. Oh! Six, five. Not bad. Five G just I'll means five points. <laughs> and there's one point in it. What rolling as we head into the quarter time break. It is a shootout and a tight one. Uh, let's have a look at the scores again. Six, five, 41. Plays six, six, 42. Hawthorne have possession heading into this second quarter. Warped. Off you go. What a reply. Oh, no, five, it's five ones, not too bad. We got the initial reaction off the one, but it's straight kicking. Five goals, one, takes him to 11 at 6.72. This is a high-scoring affair. Back to the Sydney Swans, off you go, Park. Oh. Five one as well. Oh. No, one five. Oh. One five. <laughs> I got excited. It's the opposite way around, and that... Is some poor kicking. Plenty of forward entries there, Parts, but only 11 points for the quarter. Moves you to 7 11 53. Plays 11 6 72 for the Hawks. Quite a handy buffer as we head into half time. 
halftime break now, and we'll get a chance to look at facilities down at Hawthorne. They maintain using these awful chairs. Uh, have a look at James Sicily last week. Yeah, full neck support behind him. Don't know why you'd need that. And again, Warple with that chair this week. Functionality over fashion, but much like their jerseys, they're ugly, but they seem to be effective. Let's have a look at the halftime scores again. 11-6-72 Hawthorne play Sydney 7-11-53. A 19-point buffer in favour of the Hawks. James, you got jumped early in that first quarter, but uh, you managed to come back. What did the coach say at halftime? Yeah, um, Clarko still wasn't happy. Um, you know, I still rolled a one. He, he wants three or above, so I'm going to try my best to get that. Yeah, understandable. Uh, across to Parker now, what was said in your rooms, Parks, after a hot start? Yeah, he was happy getting off to a flyer, but um, he started to question the defence since uh, they've kicked 11 goals and a half. So <laughs> hopefully we'll have to turn it around. <laughs> well, good luck. There's the siren as we head into the all-important third quarter. It's back with Luke Parker with dice in hand, an absolute ivory magnet. Off you go, buddy. Oh, no. Say guys. <laughs> one, one. Oh dear, one, one. Only the seven points as Hawks had a chance to increase their legs. Off you go, Warps. Two, three. Not a huge amount of damage. Two, three, 15 points for that quarter. Moving to 13, nine, 87 plays Sydney. Eight, 12, 60. A 27 point buffer. For the Hawks, it's the Hawks with dice in hand. They could put it out of their reach if they start quick here. Warped off you go. Four, six. I think that'll be enough to do it. 30 points there for the quarter. 117. Yep. <laughs> it plays 8, 12, 60. Bucks. It's too hard to come back, but the percentage is going to be a, a big part of this season. Obviously, only four games in it. Off you go, mate. 2-4. Not great. And it is a decisive victory to the Hawks. You can hear the theme song <laughs> around. A great in for Warple. Uh, obviously, resting Sicily, Warps seem to be the right approach. Yeah, well, I think... You know, I'm just a better dice roller than James is. I think he spends a bit too much time on PlayStation, so his wrists are a bit a bit floppy. So, um, yeah, mine are a bit stronger and a bit better for dice rolling. Yeah, uh, an inspired move from the coach. Congratulations, buddy. As we just mentioned, the Hawks, uh, huge winners. 41 points over Sydney. Uh, you can go to afl.com.au forward slash dice footy if you want to participate at all, toss the coin, or watch any of the other matches and we'll wrap up Saturday Football shortly with Port Adelaide versus Brisbane, 7.40. We'll see you then. <laughs>